It's time for the sport. Let's go live now to Joe. And Joe, we're going for person of the year to sports person of the year. Absolutely, yes, Hella. Um, LeBron James has been named Time Magazine's Athlete of the Year for his work against voter suppression. The LA Lakers star helped his team to the NBA title earlier this year, but it's his work against social injustice that's been rewarded after his More Than a Vote organisation helped drive re record turnout in this year's US presidential election. I don't want to lose sight of LeBron James's awesomeness on the court. <laughs> uh, he is the greatest basketball player of his generation, arguably of any generation, and he won a fourth title this year. That's no small thing, but his true influence was what he did off of the court. And LeBron has had a remarkable influence across activism for athletes around the world. He has used his unparalleled platform as not just the most uh, talented basketball player in the world, but one of the most popular figures in the entire world to create space for other athletes to bring their full selves to their sports and no longer feel there was a trade-off between success on the court and principle off of it. Specifically this year, with his More Than a Vote organization, he engaged directly in the democratic process, registering tons of people to vote, tens of thousands of volunteers to work at the polls, and he used his leverage to persuade the NBA's billionaire owners to convert many of the stadiums and arenas into polling places, enabling more people to vote safely while social distancing. I think it is not an overstatement to say that he had a direct impact on the presidential election. Well, LeBron's participation at next year's Olympics in Tokyo is still up in the air, but if he goes and raises social justice issues at the Games, he'll be supported by his country's Olympic Committee. The US OPC has announced they won't punish athletes who peacefully and respectfully demonstrate. That goes against Rule 50 of the Olympic Charter, which prohibits any kind of demonstration, but it comes in response to calls to change that rule from Team USA's Council on Racial and Social Justice. In a statement on Thursday, the Council said... The silencing of athletes during the Games is in stark contrast to the importance of recognising participants in the Games as humans first and athletes second.